Welcome to Crazy Downs, 10 minutes or less. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. And we got a special guest today. Yeah, who's joining us today? We Jeremiah. Have... Jeremiah, welcome, dude. Thanks for joining us on the uh, on the old podcast. Thanks for having me. All right. Well, look, are we going to set the time or we're going to get right into it? So... We don't have a backstory for Jeremiah. <laughs> we don't know no origin story. <laughs> I died in a war long ago. Okay. Yeah, he, he's he's come back. So, anyways, I know, I've known Jeremiah a long time, and uh, we wanted to bring him on the podcast to uh, to be funny with us. You know, but we need somebody funny on here, right? Pressure's on for once, <laughs> right? For once. So, anyways, all right. Uh, Jeremiah actually sent me some topics, so I'm gonna go with those. Uh, we'll we'll okay. let the, the the guests bring the heat. So, uh, let's start with uh, TNT Dynamite. Jeremiah, what is your favorite music video of all time, or what is the best music video of all time? What did I'll you say, you. TNT? You want me to go first? I already yeah. know the answer. <laughs> you already know the answer. I There's only one if... correct there. It's Jeremiah's. Yeah. Well, so it's, a, it's a podcast, so I'm going to give a long-winded answer. I don't mm -hmm. know if I necessarily can say, like, a music video that I feel is, like, the best or, like, the quintessential music video, the one mm -hmm. that, like, surpasses all. But I can speak for one that had the most influence for me, and it's going to have to be a toss up between crying by Aerosmith and crazy by Aerosmith. Wait, the Aerosmith double feature is your yeah. favorite? Set? Is it like Alicia Silverstone thing? No, it is not an Alicia Silverstone <laughs> thing. I grew up I grew up in the inner city Cleveland, all right? When my when my family finally got cable and MTV came around, mm -hmm. this was my first experience with rock music. Oh, okay. I have never okay. heard anything like that in my life. So when I heard Crazy and Crying, I was like, these songs are amazing. There's a okay. whole nother genre of music out there that I've never indulged in. And since then, I've never looked back, man. You know, it's like, I, I mean, I still listen to a lot of what be uh, what be considered like inner city music, but I love rock music to this day. And those two music videos open the pathways for me to indulge in just a different Whoa. genre of music so hmm. and well, oddly me, enough alicia is. silverstone was in both and she was pretty she hot was. back then so she was I mean, that, that one she scene she's, off a bridge right yeah yeah or she's flipping <laughs> off yeah. the camera yeah <laughs> exactly all right well could jeremiah what about you what's your, what's your answer sabotage by oh Beastie by the beast oh. that is the most fun shit I, I don't know if it tells a story it seems to but like <laughs> that's just, it's just captivating you can watch that with mute and it, to me that's that's awesome hey, it, what I, happens in that video i don't remember they all dress up like cops, and then they run around the city uh, with this old up, like I don't know if it's like a '84 Cutlass or some shit like that, <laughs> like a cop car, okay, jumping yeah, over yeah. train tracks, chasing bad guys. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a um, one of those like fake documentaries about, and they're like being like they're, they're like running and sliding over the hood and shit, yep. and <laughs> you, you know that's actually yeah yeah you know. And I don't want to like say Thriller by Michael Jackson, but like oh my god, oh, you're not even wrong yeah. though. Yeah, <laughs> when I, I was right. a kid. Like I just remember being like that. I would that would come on ninety seven times a day on MTV, and I would just watch it every single time yeah, yeah, it was yeah. on. I'm gonna change my answer. That, no, that that's a really that's a solid yeah, choice. A, that's a solid choice. That's a movie. It, it, right, and I don't want to be the guy who goes thriller because everybody's like thrillers, are, but it's like it's an experience. Yeah, that one and like it would have bit me. <laughs> that one and like uh. November Rain. Stupid. I don't remember. Yeah, I was gonna say November Rain. Yeah. Yeah, cause they're like cine cinematic masterpieces of like yeah. music video, but uh, you know, it's it's they they really like. I mean, wh like when you when I saw this question, the first thing that came to my head was like, oh, Thriller, because it was like, dude, the choreographed zombies like dancing around, like doing all the people still do that Thriller dance, and it's like thirty five years later. However, yeah. how like yeah, thirty five yeah. years. Yeah. If I uh, if I ever get married again and have a big ceremony, which I won't, I'm gonna make everyone do the <laughs> I'm gonna make everyone do the thriller dance just at have the wedding. Blow over and make them do it. <laughs> at my <laughs> funeral, I'm gonna be like, get me out of the casket. You hold me up, and <laughs> if you don't do that, I'm gonna haunt every one of you mofos for the Plus rest. Postpone your funeral three weeks and then <laughs> look real oh. fresh. <laughs> so right, we want the real zombie effect. <laughs> So you listen to, uh, Jeremiah, you listen to, to mostly rock music, huh? Uh, primarily, because I'm a more a guitar player. So oh, yeah, you play, you play an instrument, too. Play them all, man. 
so you played many instruments yeah that's kind of my jam um i don't know any reliable musicians so i just taught myself the drums the bass violin i got that in there some keyboards but i think i write everything on guitar like if i'm just going to be hanging out i'm playing guitar okay what kind um, of what kind of music do you do you produce um it what i do is like rock um i don't know what to call, maybe primus meets clutch meets pantera uh, like i just make songs for people to either laugh or like i got people in my life that mean something i write something for them try to make okay. them smile but yeah I, I don't try to appeal to a large crowd um more targeted make what you want and you're like like yeah, it or don't make a song about karen's make a song saying thank you to a good friend <laughs> okay. so who, who does wife. vocals who does vocals uh, i do i'm not very good at it <laughs> i i suck it up man um right. i don't know anyone to come sing it and I, if i'm right. trying to write the types of songs i'm writing it should probably come from me so um i'm the i'm the worst guy at the karaoke bar <laughs> yeah it is what it is <laughs> but it makes sense dude because if you want to do something just do it and make it happen because i wanted to do a podcast forever <clears throat> back in the day and i could never find people that wanted to commit and then i finally said f it i'm just gonna do it and do it by myself and then i did five episodes this guy came to visit me and my ex-wife we did a podcast together and here we are five i was like hey you want to do one yeah. while we're visiting and then here we are five years later we're still doing the podcast but See, if i would have never started i never would have done it so yeah and it's awesome to have someone come come along for the ride whatever you're doing because you have multiple input as well right so mm -hmm. i'm sure you guys have discussions on what's what's a going to be a better approach and that's healthy that's the one thing i miss from what the kind of you know thing i do with on my own mm -hmm. yeah just having yeah. band members to kind of bounce ideas off of yeah, yeah, I'll have just songs marinating for like I've half been, a year. I've been trying to get Jonas to write lyrics because we're yeah. supposed to have a CD that comes a rap, out. A rap single. He wants to drop a rap single. Yeah, I so hope if, you guys do that. Okay, see, <laughs> look, look, look. Yeah. All right, we. I did a rap song. I can't rap either, but <laughs> I did one just Santa you. Claus. Yes, give me, give me, give me sixteen. Give me a sixteen. We'll get it in there. You can do the hook. Yeah. Yeah. Think of a hook. I'll go Nate Dog on a hook. <laughs> there you go. Like yeah. the king of hooks, man. Oh yeah, you can get that real deep voice like yeah, you're talking you Johnny just, Cash. And... You just talk real low and you do like five of them. Stack them. <laughs> See? I'm not mad at that. I like that. All right. Like that. Sixteen. Sixteen bars. All I right. Like that. Yeah. So uh well yeah, because you said you do keyboard, right? So you can get a nice you can get a nice like an you'll be the Dr. Dre of the of the you'll put the beat and <laughs> you'll be the Dre and the Nate Dog. I'll come up with something for you for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what yeah, you, we do a, a rock edge. I can do a straight hip hop edge, whatever you want. Um, nice. So yeah, that nice. that actually sounds exciting. You guys really know. <laughs> yeah. Like how could we guy. do that? I like this. How could we do that virtually though? Like, would you just have to do the music side and then we'll do it recorded over this? <laughs> I can write sixteen bar loop. Uh, you guys can listen to it, say what you want it to change or what you like, don't like, and then you put on headphones, sing into your phone. And then well, see, you guys know you music. I'm like the beginning, everybody. You guys, yeah. you guys are talking about 16 bar loop. I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. So I'm like, it's just a pattern. Like you hear, um, um, uh, forgot about Drake. Dun 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 dun. And just that. That's probably a, a, you know one bar pattern. 16 bars is so typically how long you would do a a hip hop verse. Mm -hmm. You throw a little hook in. So you, depends on what you're doing. You do like 16 bars hook, 16 bars. Hook, 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 hook yeah, out. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Maybe or we could do a rock talks. song. Do yeah, we, we can do that too. We do both. I'm probably yeah. gonna rap over my rock, or you know, I'll sing. I guess it could maybe. start out as a rock song and then turn into a rap song by the it, end. It could just be. We could just be. Uh, <laughs> be its own thing, man. It could be the right. same thing. It could just be the gorillas where they do both. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. You got so, a cartoon. It, yeah. What? <laughs> Yeah. cartoon i can't draw uh, no I'm just yeah. yeah that would be nice. oh that would be cool you, yeah do it and then get someone to like animate us that would be cheap because you know artists charge nothing to do their work <laughs> <laughs> you're always like hey you want to do some free art they're like no no not i don't at all are you going to charge us is this a, is this a trick is this <laughs> is a bait this and a switch <laughs> I, uh, uh, i'm hoping to lure somebody in to help me <laughs> yeah you're like we get done yeah. all of a sudden i get like a venmo request from you you're like oh yeah. hey thirty five thousand dollars like, 
<laughs> Jonas says he makes a couple podcasts, introduces <laughs> you, and now you both are doing like, hey, I can do that. That's an idea. All right. If I, if I receive an itemized invoice, I am going to have it. <laughs> It'll be like so production, like, you know. drums. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, but anyways, back to, back to these music videos. Can you think of a music video that you absolutely hate? Yes. Black Hole Sun, Black Hole Sun by Soundgarden. You hate that. You hate that, that video. video. That video used to give me people. nightmares, Jonas. <laughs> nightmares. <laughs> yeah, I could see that. I could see that. No, I, uh... his face opening up. No, I don't need to see that. And the cook on the grill. I don't even remember what he was cooking on the grill, but it was some <laughs> bullshit. Uh, there was that, uh, what, wasn't there a Mariah Carey song that was about, like, her going to, like, a fantasy land or something? Sweet, like... sweet fantasy baby with Bone Thugs. Oh, my God, yeah, oh, dude. Yeah. I hated that video. It was on MPB <laughs> all the time. <laughs> yeah, dude. Dibbit. Oh, and, uh, uh, the video at the time was really cool, but over time it's gotten more annoying that I lost more set one where she's, like, four times in the video. Oh, in the car? Yeah. Is that yeah I like that video. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's a good video, like, but, like, I was like, man, the more I think about it, I'm like, I don't know. What about I'm you, Jeremiah? Is there any video you Aqua hate? Aqua Barbie. Oh my I god. I can't see that. I can't They're all in the car. It. They're driving yeah. around. Oh, dude, that is... I, yeah, that's Eiffel a... 65 Blue is a pretty bad video. I don't even know what that is. No. I'm blue. Oh. I'm blue. Yeah. Oh, what about this I'm Only 17 video? I'm just bringing up some really disgusting song from the 80s. It's all right. <laughs> well, she's song. only 17? Yeah, she's yeah. Only 17. You know, we've talked about this, Jeremiah, and I'll bring it up with you because you like music. <sighs> Looking back, that that song was on the fucking radio, and it's oh. about a, a grown-ass man fucking yeah. underage girls. That's like, like one thing that'll lose me, uh, <laughs> that kind of shit. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. You hear it, you'll hear it a lot in, in rock, and, it, and in the 80s particularly, it seemed to be a... A cool yeah, thing. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was the like, hey, let's talk about all the underage groupies. <laughs> yeah. The last band that got that off would be Sublime. When they said oh, that with... Annie's 12 years old and two more yeah. to be a whore. I was like, yeah, no. yeah. That was probably the last. <laughs> yeah. 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 And that song was on the radio too. Like, that was yeah. a very popular yeah. song. You're talking about like underage girls being solicited for. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know how in like how, how time, how times have changed. You know, that's what it's they say. It's opposite now. Yeah. They, like young gravies hauling out Martha Stewart, older ladies, <laughs> bills, bills. <laughs> They're gonna be talking yeah. about be geriatric yeah. songs. He's trying to come over, hang out with your mom. <laughs> we singing about old ladies now. Is that what oh yeah, mean? yeah, it's young gravy. Yeah. Hey, that's that's the first single. We talk about going to the nursing home and picking up some girls because we're we're all washed. <laughs> oh yeah. We're all over the age of a certain age, and we're washed. So now we got fish go in a the... barrel, man. Yeah, it's right, <laughs> right. Yeah. I mean, you go in. You're like, "How you doing today, Gertrude? You're looking pretty nice." All right. You're in. Okay. You want to go to Cracker single. Barrel? <laughs> <laughs> I got a coupon. Yeah. yeah. It's Sunday afternoon. Yeah. You know CD what that discount. means. Discount. Yep. Exactly. You get that. What they call? What yeah. used to call that? It's like the fast food restaurants. The so, something. The silver. The silver discount or something like that. Because you could show the card. If you had the AARP card, they give you ten percent off at Wendy's. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Back home by six thirty, baby. <clears throat> Anyways, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe. Jeremiah, you want to pimp something? You got a, something you want to, people to go look at? Yeah, go check out it. my music videos. It's Jeremiah Mixed Media on YouTube, or you just search his name on Facebook. All right, all cool. kinds of videos for you. All right, thanks for, for having for, me, man. No problem for Jonas. TNT and Jeremiah. All right, we out.